All right, let's start by talking about something really exciting. USA now will get a taste of India. What am I talking about? Well, India's very own Amul, the taste of India, will soon be available outside India in the US markets. Amul has tied up with the US-based Michigan Milk Producers Association in a first-of-its-kind collaboration by an Indian cooperative sector dairy player. Now, the Gujarat Cooperative Milk Marketing Federation, which owns the brand Amul, will make fresh milk brands such as Amul Gold, Amul Taza, Amul Shakti, Amul Slim and Trim, basically four variants of the milk that are so popular here in the country. And they will be available in the US in a matter of weeks from now. And it won't stop at Dood. Eventually, other products as well like paneer, curd, buttermilk, all will hit the shelves. This is of course to address the Indian diaspora and the ever-expanding market for milk. But the question really is, as somebody who loves milk, will the taste be the same? Well, what we are learning is that the recipe of the milk sold under the brand Amul will be owned by the Indian cooperative. Here are more details. Take a look. Gujarat Cooperative Milk Marketing Federation, better known as Amul, has forayed into US. Amul has tied up with 108-year-old cooperative organization Michigan Milk Producers Association to launch fresh milk in the US markets. Until now, Amul was exporting milk and products to US as it does to 50 other countries. But in a first under this arrangement, Amul has launched fresh milk to US consumers, which does consist in a big number of Asians and Indian diaspora. The initial launches are of four fresh milk products, which is Amul Taza, Amul Gold, Amul Shakti and Amul Slim and Trim. Amul will now be available in New York, New Jersey, Chicago, Washington, Texas, Dallas and many other regions. Under this tie-up, milk collection and processing will be done as per Amul recipe by MMPA and the marketing and branding will be done by Amul. I caught up exclusive with Jain Mehta, who's MD Amul, and asked him on the pricing of the fresh milk in US, and this is what he had to say. There are two ways to looking at it. A, it's a very competitive market, so I'm sure we're going to get the best price for milk there. B, uh, we are selling a product which is actually not available or never ever been sold to in the US market, which is a milk with 6% milk fat. So this is the Amul Gold pack, which is the same pack design, product recipe, uh, that you have in India will be available there. So obviously this will be premium priced. Uh, so we, we are not looking at a price competition there. We are looking at creating a brand and deriving value out of the proposition we give in the products that we offer to our customers. I also asked Mr. Mehta on the next in the list after US and if there are more regions that the Indian milk company was looking at. The US is very important and that's how we started into that market. There are a few other regions where we are actively pursuing such opportunities and uh, very soon, hopefully, we should be revealing uh, their names and the status of the association. Jain Mehta also tells us that with the kind of milk consumption US has, they are looking at bigger, better volumes going forward. US typically, every household consumes 75 to 100 gallons uh, a, a year, which is uh, two gallons per week. So it's it's pretty pretty good consumption of milk uh, and milk products as you may call them. So I think uh, to be fair enough, it's in the first quarter we will just uh, focus on uh, expanding the distribution, making the product available at all the Indian grocery stores, uh, the supermarket chains, uh, or possibly also tying up with the mainstream uh, some of the chains which do sell large volumes of milk. All right, so that's an exciting first.